Black Panther made history when it hit theaters with Chadwick Boseman front and center. But now the show goes on and someone else could claim the role. Why fans say, some at least, that that cannot happen. Chills. Black Panther is more than just a superhero flick. For so many, it represents a cultural moment. And Chadwick Boseman will forever be remembered for his portrayal of T'Challa. But should he be recast? Tens of thousands of people who have signed a petition think so. A local film critic started it. We say good morning to Emmanuel Email. Eman Noizette, thank you for joining us this morning. I understand you're very close to your goal, uh, 55,000 signatures, if not already there. Why did you start this petition? So, first of all, thank you for having me. Look, in August of 2020, uh, Chadwick Boseman passed away, and I think it hit all of us. Uh, in December of 2020, Marvel made the announcement that they did not want to recast the role, mm -hmm. and I think that shocked me and a lot of other people because either you're going to throw that character in the background or you're going to kill him off. Um, and that right there was definitely unsettling. So, basically, I did a deep dive in Chadwick Boseman's interviews. He interviewed, uh, he spoke to Roland Martin and told him that he wanted people to see the role and not him. Mm. That's the job of an actor to do what you do with the role. So it was at that point I launched the petition. Um, and it's very simple. We don't need an immediate recast. Mm -hmm. We're not saying someone else can't take up the mantle. We just don't want Marvel using Chadwick Boseman's real life tragedy and passing as a plot device in their fictional storytelling. Mm. Uh, his brother. Chadwick's brother has supported this petition and this movement as well. He says he believes his brother would have wanted to be recasted. So what was your reaction when you heard that the, the brother weighed in here? Yeah, listen, that was a great sense of validation. I mean, who better to know Chadwick Boseman than his own older brother? Um, and it was just a very, very great sense of endorsement uh, coming from the family. I don't want to put you on the spot, but who <laughs> would you like to see as the next Black Panther? Would you like to see them go younger, go older? Listen, superheroes are made for kids. I don't care who they get, honestly. It's because this is all about having that representation on screen. But if you need a couple names, Yahya Abdul-Mateen II, mm -hmm. John David Washington, okay. Amson Idris, Trevante Rhodes, there's no shortage of talented black actors not named Michael B. Jordan that can deserve that opportunity for a great role. So true, and I would love to, I know if this movie was made in the 90s, Denzel Washington would have for sure been Black Panther. I don't know how you would feel about taking on the role right now at this day and age, but my goodness, what a great conversation, my man. Um, Black Panther 2, that comes out this summer, correct? Uh, November, got pushed November. back to November okay. of this year. All right, yeah, because they've had some COVID things going on there, and storyline and rewrites and whatnot. I could talk to you all day. I'm pretty sure Jake could talk to you as well all day. <laughs> Appreciate your time this morning, E-Man. Thank you so much. All right. You have a good one. Let's check in with you Mike too. now. Get a look at our forecast this morning. Wakanda. Forever. Yeah, we had no, our I wish, own Wakanda. I wish we were in Wakanda. That's it's right. A lot warmer there. I got to say this. I want his microphone set up. Yes. You hear right? how good that sounds? So I mean, he's cool got a good voice, too. too but he's got, he's got the full <laughs> setup going on there.